I want to go see this, I want to see that. I want to see Humming Bee cheering in a French crowd. But we're locked in. Going into game one. As expected, you wouldn't have it any other way. Warrior versus Chicklipum. We're back to Hall of Bastion. It's like we never left. And this is winner's quarters, so... Yeah, winner of this is going into a, a top one. And Glutin is happy to start off this game. Standing perfectly still. Base Mage is like, I'm going to use that to my advantage. But Glutin already... Oh. The up B to get Jigglypuff off him. It's just also back and forth already. They are hardcore scrapping right now, Moak. Yeah, meanwhile, of course, Base Mage had that little bit of a scrap, but then goes, I'm going to go nice and high, <laughs> chill out for a bit. But the thing that Base Mage has, of course, is the advantage state from Jigglypuff. That character is no joke. You know, in a, in a game like Smash Ultimate, some of Jigglypuff's hold forward options are really strong. That pounds, so much shield pressure. Definitely. The Nair, so much pressure. Some of the frame there, low key, pretty good. So it's whether or not a character like Glutiny, you know, kind of stubby little legs, not the best range. It's like two characters with pretty good air speed. So we'll see how it plays out. Right, yeah. now it's not playing out too well for Glutiny. He needs to get a combo started, get those oh. hits, and as I say that, Base Mage getting the first hit, first kill, and taking Gluto stock. And that is the air speed of Jigglypuff in action. You saw there the down air on Glutony's shield. Base Mage was able to fade away. Glutony thought he had a punish. He did not have a punish, yeah. and he died for it. Oh, we're seeing maybe the down tilt there, maybe popping Base Mage up. Didn't want to commit with the dash attack. But he's still in his yeah. That back air is definitely going to take it. I was saying, you know, Jigglypuff has some pretty good hold forward options, but. Uh, fade back back air, gonna kill most characters there, especially one as light as the pink balloon. Yeah, we're seeing the up airs, we're seeing the collapse coming out already 50% on base mage. Yeah, Glutiny happy to kind of play passive. And of course, as Wario, you don't mind kind of holding back a little bit because it means you're charging that resource. Yeah. You get an extra waft. But the confirm oh, from base wow. mage jumping out of his chair. I think people in the crowd are jumping yeah. out of the chair for that one. Took really Glutiny for a ride. And that is it, the explosive power, you know. We're used to seeing it in melee, but in ultimate, the rest confirms you can find a kill out of nowhere sometimes. I know the down air combo starters, the damage continues. But Gluto stuffing out and he is glowing. Yeah, we I was going to say, speaking of explosive power, he got his. Yeah, saving it for that last stock, I'm sure. He needs to find a way, taking the lead back. He probably could have got the confirm there on the uh, the hurtbox extension for the bike there. Base Mage getting stuck in that uh, down air. Lorraine Gluto, you want to save it for the last stock. So he's just trying to take the kill. Yeah, a little bit of cat and mouse right, right now. Base Mage, the Waft's already charged, so there's not too much Gluto he gets from, from chilling out. Oh, the, uh -oh. Ooh, not quite the angle to get on the platform. Trade. Base Mage still hanging in there. Base Mage's in-game tag, calm. He's taking his time. But I say that, yeah. it goes for that aggressive <laughs> dash attack. <laughs> And the forward throw yeah. again, but that is it. Some characters, a forward throw from Jigglypuff spells their end. Oreo has that bike. Like, still barely hanging in there as Jiggly. Yeah, that bike, still living. Oh yeah, just spacing Gluto. underneath the bike and base mage going nice and high. 160, a character as light as Jigglypuff, living to 160, and still getting damage on as well. Yeah. Possibly. Oh, the bike oh. may have betrayed Glutin yeah. there a little bit. The hurtbox extensions. Yeah. Oh, back airs. Look at our hungry box right on. now. These yeah. back airs are looking <laughs> crazy. Glutin really struggling to get this kill on base right now. And oh. as I say that, the bike dash that. Yeah, where do you go? Which way you How go? How do you get out of that? But the waft is online. Glutin with rage. Jiggly. Base is at death oh. percent. And are we going to see it? Oh. Here he waits. I think Glutiny jumped out. I think Glutiny knew, knew it wasn't a true confirm, so yeah. decided to wait for the air dodge. And all of a sudden, it was looking so strong for base mage, but Glutiny powering up a little bit. The tide is turning in his favor. And the rage as well. And oh, oh tries to use a bike to extend the, uh, the hitbox. It's like, I've had so many bike extensions not go my way this game so far. I want one to try and work in my favor, but the waft is gone. I mean, Jigglypuff such a light character with this rage. Probably not going to need the one to kill. Yeah. Oh, the bike as well. Using, yeah, using the bike to. Oh, and the roll, yeah. And all, yeah. But base reverse. Oh, the bear. Yeah, going so far oh, now. Oh, he took it. Bear and taking Pluto's stock and taking the first game.
base mage on the board there. It looked like looting in that last game was just slowly creeping back. It's like, oh yeah. no. The waft was used, and then of course, that is the power of the offstage play from base mage. You know, I think the bike was gone. I think Glutiny, yeah. I think there was not much he could really do, but base mage can go so deep with that nair. Waft was gone, bike was gone. His his um, options off stage were just limit, limited. Yeah, we talked about all the options that Warrior yeah. has to recover, but this was gone, this yeah. is gone. <laughs> Yeah, great stuff to base mage there. I think this is the life of, you know, Wario, a character with such great airspeed. You're so used to having that kind of advantage of being able to weave around, but it's like, ah, oh, I see your airspeed and I raise you yeah. more airspeed. Well, I'm not quite sure how it works out between the two, but Jigglypuff it can be so hard to pin down. That floaty character, but moves through the air so fast. One single jump, you can go so yeah. far. Literally, a balloon gets carried away by the wind. Carried away by the wind, but hopefully not by the wind coming out of Wario's derriere. We're going into game two. Base mage with the game. 1-0 up. On small battlefield. Yeah, small battlefield. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. I guess it kind of like maybe works out. I think pretty neutral stage maybe. We will see how it goes, but a good start here for Gluto. Already 60%, 70, 76. Given Jiggly, given base their hands right now. And it's like classic kind of cat and mouse game. We saw for a lot of that game, base match was kind of trying to maybe uh, go after Glutiny. Glutiny trying to take his time. Trying to maybe force the error from base mage, but we might see more of the same starting off well for Gluto. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, we're seeing, we, we were seeing something. There was there was sharking in the water right there, base yeah. mage. Gluto's here. Oh, the Back air, not quite enough. Barely taking it. And Gluto just empty yeah. opening around, trying to bait something out of base mage. Yeah. That fourth or a classic, but yeah, jump, go high with the bike. And stayed on the bike and oh. the back here taking the stop. Yeah, that is the life, of course. We said on some characters that is a 50 50 with that forward throw, but Warrior's like, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm a cycle away. Yeah, retreating yeah. there. Yeah. The get off me. Yeah. <laughs> Why is this balloon chasing me? <laughs> Basically, he's just trying to corner glute on me, but he's just using the right moves there to keep him away. Oh, the stick. Oh, there. yeah. Maybe, maybe a slight misinput there, but it works out because Glutiny stuffs out, but yeah, the neutral is so delicate here from both players. Two very explosive characters, you know, we saw that sync of uh, uh, coming in from um, Base Mage a little bit earlier. Yeah. Oh, the air dodge away from Base Mage, He's now at ledge. Pluto keeping slapped. him there and he is glowing, the man is glowing, you know what's coming next, Moog. Glutiny slapping Base Mage away a few times there, using the little bit of range that he does have. The stubby arms of Jigglypuff. A little bit difficult. Sometimes, oh, that nearly killed. Yeah. The DI good enough, though. And yeah, Glutiny struggling that first game. is kind of running away with the second game. Yeah, he's dominating right now. That, that up B going to send Ace Mage into the blast zone. Oh, this might the, even the not quite enough. Yeah, I was yeah. like, well, I mean, Jigglypuff's light, but surely not that light. In that position. That's but, definitely going to yeah. take it, though. And Waft is still there. He has not used Waft. Yeah, this is it. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh this is it, all right. Yeah, Gruto losing his stock to base mage, taking it with a ref. But Gruto is not letting that stop him. It's giving him the up end. He is clapping him. He is ready to maybe finish this with a waft. Yeah, that, that looked really, it looked really cool. <laughs> the parry into the rest really cool, but then confirmed 50% put on even by Gruto. Didn't even need the waft. 50% on the respawn platform it was enough fuel to then finish. The JV3. The JV3. 1 1 here. Yeah, Glutiny felt like he was struggling a little bit that first game. Was certainly in it, but second game reminding everyone why he is, uh, he is France's number one. Yeah. And yeah, we're seeing. The stage pick was interesting. I wondered if it was a. Uh... Maybe it was the same as like with Sora, just because like Jigglypuff is so floaty and everywhere, using the two platforms to be able to actually catch Jiggly in the air. Yeah, possibly. I think I maybe saw um, uh, Smashville as the counter pick there from Base Mage. I think again, I think Base Mage is like, you know what? I'm getting kind of a... Just, I'm, I'm struggling to catch the Warrior. Maybe I want to scrap a little bit. So Smashville is the pick, a small stage. More hits from Jigglypuff are going to send Warrior off stage. Which, I know the recovery is good, but it's still a good situation for Jigglypuff. He's starting off well. Oh, oh, stage, yep, yeah, but the, the bike, the coming bike coming to immediately. Save him. Yep. He knew right away it needed to get out of that situation or I could have died. 59% here. 
Oh, oh wow. The classic. Some, sometimes that's not a true combo. Right. And base mage knew it. What confirmed. That is so because if you get that wrong, oh, you're in trouble. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> But the, 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 the risk the knowledge, paid off. The knowledge, the risk reward, the reward's certainly worth it. Big lead here for base mage. And the down airs. The back air coming out. The bike is now on stage. Probably going to use it to try and help him get the kill to narrow where base mage can retreat to. In the dash back there, really strong from Gluto. Able to get a punish. And to say that kill was pretty early. Gluto getting a lot of damage here, 122. Oh, that was beautiful little backlash there from Gluto and the down tilt to catch him. Yeah, the dash back's been really strong from Gluto. Just trying to bait base mage into holding forward a little bit further than he needs to, but... Oh, oh. should be fine. Yeah, maybe yeah. Not, not quite a two frame. The air dodge back to stage from Jigglypuff, such a good option. Yeah. Oh, the falling up there. Oh, yeah. The, the little feet from Wario, <laughs> enough uh, Jigglypuff to send uh, send us the blaster at that percent. It's an even game. Oh, oh he tried it again. <laughs> Interesting, Gluto doesn't want to go for any sort of big like combo or anything. He's like, yeah. I'll just take the raw, it's raw damage. Yeah. Yeah. I think the jump's gone, you know. I think the jump's gone. <gasps> the jump's but gone. Out the oh. gone as well, and so is Gluto. I was like, I was like, did my eyes deceive you? Yeah. It's Gluto. Oh no. That is the. Uh, this is looking bad for Gluto right now, Moak. You have to save your resources and... Oh, but speaking of resources, one yep. just come online for Gluto. But will he be using it? Here's the question of whether to save it. The last stock, I mean, Jigglypuff, a light character. I mean, you can usually find kills from most percents, but you might, you might even see Gluto at this rate, use it as a recovery option, like exactly. we said. Exactly. Wait and see, but Base Mage playing with more confidence now. Base Mage being very smart about these grabs and getting them consistently as well. Oh, just stuffing out the bike there. The jab. Gets slapped in the face for good measure. <laughs> bike is in hand. Great air dodge. Oh, that was so yeah. nice using the bike as a wall once again. Bluto is very good at that. Yeah, the options select again. Air dodge is through the bike, but then can you get the whip punish? Oh, oh no. no! Didn't even have a chance to yeah. use the what? He was finished. Two fantastic edge guards from base mage. And oh my goodness. Fortune, I think we are. It's Bluto on the final game of winners. Yeah. It's looking difficult here. I get Gluto started that so well, actually, to be fair. It's like, oh, okay, Gluto kind of cooking. Yeah. But then Base Mage, just such an explosive player. Getting the grabs at the right moment, knocking Gluto off stage, prioritizing Gluto being off stage, knowing I can take away your resources one by one, and then what will you be able to do? Nothing. All right, base Mage locked in. You see such an animated guy in his chair. I love seeing it, you know, just the, the little confirms. I lo I absolutely love that he went for the uh, the rest out of the up throw yeah. up there. It's like, no, 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 this isn't true. Yeah. This isn't true. And he tried to do it again and he got punished for it. But the crowd is coming alive right now, cheering for their man, their savior, Glutoni. With Base Mage, is it going to be the new team? Is it the sponsor curse? He's two on up. It's set point here. From Battlefield, a great stage for Wario. And a pretty good stage for Jigglypuff, so we'll see how it works out. And already the aggressive pound. Oh. Oh, Wario retaliating. Rutoni already putting 41% on Base Mage right now. Just dancing between the platforms, just waiting for Base Mage to come in so he can punish appropriately. Yeah, and we see Rutoni trying to opt for that more cat and mouse game. Getting a little bit of early damage. Kind of a similar story to the previous game, but we, we know how that one ended. Yep. Maybe this one will end different this time. But Base Mage is pushing, pushing his advantage right now. Yeah, the bike's been used to recover. He's while the bike's on stage, that is one less recovery option for Gluttony, but... So if I just ended it straight away. <laughs> air dodging through. No down tilt dash attack. It's in the back air, not quite enough. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. The little feedbacks from Gluttony have been so important in this game and the previous game. Just trying to find moments. A base major for extending. Yeah, the bike. 47. Oh yeah. Nice catch there from Gluto. Taking base major stock. Oh but yeah. Base major retaliating with the falling up into the rest. I saw that up there. I'm like, I bet. This, I think I know <laughs> yeah, what the confirm is going to be. Next. Up throw down B. No no no. Warrior, you're not <laughs> the only one who can do this. The Jigglypuff confirmed much the same. That's a pretty even game, and we saw yeah. <laughs> Gluttony just waited back a bit. 
Go for the raw dash attack. He gets stuffed out. Oh. Yeah. All right. Good recovery from base mage. Yeah. Grab throwing him back off stage again. Rita coming down with a down air. Oh, we're seeing great little catch. The juggle from the up air. Has to use bike. Oh, oh what an catching smash there. him landing with the S match. He knew. Base mage yeah. was like, you've got to land somewhere. I think you're going to land right here. But no. And then Kuto's to... like, no, and I know you're going to land right here using his strong arm to take that stock. And they're both on their last stock. Last stock piece, of course, Waft online. Not seen many confirms, if any, I think, from Glutini for the Waft confirm, but oh. we've seen a lot more down special confirms yeah. from Base mage. Is he going to make winner's side? Oh, we're seeing the up tilts and the off -airs coming out. Oh you know gosh. what Bruto's looking for, but Base Mage is not going to let him have it. He's not going to let him use that waft. Oh my gosh, this is so scary. And then the rest, the rest Wait, but Bruto's still punish? living. He's not hanging in there. The waft, oh the combo. Gosh. Are we going to see oh. it? Oh, oh no, Wait. he's still going. He and it. then the waft. Oh and Base Mage is still living. Not enough. Base Mage living. The forward smash. Both players high percent. Waft now offline for 116 here. On Glutiny. This is looking scary for Kuto to throw. He is off stage. Bike is now on stage. Gonna use it to an advantage. Oh my gosh, it's so tense here. Both players. Just a Face scary situation. Face mage is so close here from defeating Glutiny. But that up air is enough. Oh, gets the dash attack, the DI. Very Just living. enough. Just enough. Using Bike once again to, to create that wall to make oh. it easier for him to hit. But Face mage with the grab. What's the ledge up going to be? The bike's off stage. The yellow's back to ledge. Isn't that safe? Yeah. There, oh, the grab the win. Bike. The bike has been destroyed. Oh, the parry. The parry. Into the grab here, Glutiny. Just high. Oh, my God. And that's going to kill him. And we are going to a game five mode. Oh, my life. Oh. I think base mage thought, thought he might have been safe there. But Glutiny, the little trump card, the reverse. Sending in the other direction on the down air. Beautiful stuff from Glutiny. You are never safe from Glutiny. You are in France on his home tour. He is at his, he's playing at his best right now. He is bringing it back. He might even take the win. The crowd is going wild right now, Mo. Let's go, Gluto. A chant you've heard once and you'll definitely hear again. A fantastic set here. We're going the distance. A lot of game fives, Fortune. A lot of game fives. This one could go the distance. I know base mage, you could just tell he really wants this victory. Yeah. This big tournament, the new team. Let's see if he can clutch it out. And it felt like just the little moments, the little parries from base mage, I thought it was in base mage's favor, but then yeah. just, just when you think Glutini's out of it. Then, 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 never, then. never count Gluto out. Until you see game on that screen, he is still always in it, in it to win it. That is Glutini through and through. So game five, I expect we'll be seeing much the same. Uh, of Jigglypuff versus Wario, but the stages have been pretty, in, you know, pretty interesting. Just the way both uh, players have been using the platforms. We've seen a lot of uh, on the stage deliberation on stage picks because, you know, in this sort of meta, you know, the small margins are such that you really need to make sure you're not going, you're not counterpicking yourself. Yeah. <laughs> but it is base major's counterpick. Got to make sure that every decision counts. Yeah, Gluto thinking long and hard, and yeah, I don't blame like, him where, it's game like, where five. The hell am I going? <laughs> like, oh, lo, 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 lo. Yeah, they're thinking about, it. okay, I think we're locked in. Game five here, base mage. Was on the, on the verge of taking that. The last stock, last hit situation benefits Gluto. Where the base mage can clutch it out. We've said it before, these game fives, they can often lend themselves to who has the most experience. Mm -hmm. But. You never know, we saw, we've seen before, doesn't always play out that way. Glutiny is a seasoned veteran, but base mage, he's no, he's no slouch. Exactly. Here we go, game five. Ooh. Are you ready? Because I most definitely am. And we're going oh. to the final destination. What the, per the perfect stage for this game five. The final destination, no platforms in sight. Interesting pick here from base mage here. No platform, so Gluto can't reach him, but even so, Gluto is still throwing out those kicks, those fists, the nares, the bears, the up airs, keeping the string going already at 74% base mage. Yeah, we're thinking about both these characters really enjoy the platform extensions, so I guess with base mage picking this stage, it's like, you know what? Let's have an honest battle yeah. on the stage. <laughs> no platform shenanigans. We're just going to fight. But so far, that is working in Gluto's favor. 100% almost unanswered until 
Another that confirmed. Only 31% here on Gluto. Starting to rise. Yeah. The Nair confirmed. Mike straight to the heavens, but yeah. stuffed out. Oh. Catching his land with the grab. He's off stage once again. The up B knocking him away. Base mage just brought this deficit back so quickly. Might as well. The bike is oh. in play as well. Oh, the oh. missed tech. Let's go for that roll this is attack. This scary for Gruto. Base mage on left. There's no bike in hand. Yep. Oh, so there is a bike in hand now. Throws yeah. it up, trying to get, yeah, yeah. Trying to get yeah. that mixed up. The bike covers that area of the stage. Once again, putting up that wall, which has been very handy the past few games. Yeah, base mage has been air dodging through that bike so perfectly throughout yeah. this, throughout this Beautiful step. Beautiful trap there by Brutoni, catching him with the command grab, taking his block. Bluto trying to weave around, great little parry into the grab. Bluto with first blood here. Can he keep this advantage? You know, he's had leads in this set before, but base mage has been able to do something, bring something out from the depth. Damage on here, and I think you'll see he's glowing. Yeah. We might be at the percent now, or confirm is still in the it's still in play against Jigglypuff. They got all that rage as well. <laughs> but as I say that, Base Mage gets rid of it immediately. But Gluto comes in swinging with the back air. Yeah, three little empty hops there from Base Mage, and then lands the back air when it mattered the most. And here comes the, the of course Jigglypuff has jab combos. Yeah. Crazy to say it. Oh, yeah, just, yeah. the bike positioning just scared it's, Base Mage there. Yeah. Oh, and and again. Once again, the bike is just right into the slap. Base Mage on his last stop right now. Pluto sitting happy on 40% with what? With what? Are we going to see a what kill for game five? Or is Base Mage going to bring this back? Yeah, Waft's not really been of too much use to Gluten in the Waft didn't quite work out last game for the kill. Yeah. But, oh, but there's a temptation. May we? May we? Yeah, base mage. It's fallen away from him a little bit. Jigglypuff can't afford to take too much percent. Oh, beautiful air dodge though. Oh, Gluten is stuffing out all of Base yeah. Mage's approaches. Going high, but Ooh. Base Mage. Base Mage has been ready for that bike recovery a few times now. Yeah. Nice parry there, cannot get the punish though. Oh, beautiful up smash, it's not enough. Where is a heavy boy? Jumps off the bike. Yeah. Yeah, has to air dodge. Yeah. Trying to avoid something. Catching the oh, land oh, using oh, the wall. Oh, oh. He better all there, Gluto. He knows yeah. that most of his moves are going to kill Jigglypuff anyway. Yeah. But this is still a big ask for base mage. Four throw, 175, Gluto won't die. <laughs> But he's going to use that rage to kill Jigglypuff very early. So Base Mage needs to oh. get this now, or it could be the end for him. Okay. Oh, he got it. We've got it to last stop. Game five. And already Glutiny trying to shark out where Base Mage is trying to get away. The invincibility's gone. Base Mage has to land. He has to land. Just successfully. Oh. That's, grab. That's not going to kill him, though. 157. The ambiguity, you're going to go to the side. And once him, again, on leg, is up. that going to be it? That's going to be it. Gluto takes it over Base Mage. Having him for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, sending Base Mage to loser's bracket. A brilliant performance there from Glutony, clutching it out in game five. Wow. We, uh, oh, such a disappointment for Base Mage there. Did so well, though. Yeah. What a set. What a set, indeed. And Gluto moving on, of course, sometimes Ooh. playing Mr. Number One in France on his home turf uh, is certainly enough. The crowd but definitely came alive. It gave him the extra power up he needed, reminding him, I'm in France, I'm in my turf, I'm protecting them, I'm winning this tournament. But that is it. I mean, great showing from Base Mage there. It felt like the, we kept saying the margins were so small, uh, and it felt like Base Mage was so close to clutching it out, but Gluten is showing why he is, he is the best in these parts, but shout out to Base Mage. Though. I think we'll probably see, I, something tells me this won't be the last we might see of oh, Base definitely Mage. definitely not. I think we'll go a little bit further in bracket, but yeah, Glutiny collecting his adulation as he leaves the stage, <laughs> as he should. But yeah, so many great sets in top 128 here. Um, 